Hi YouTube, it's Christian Nolan here and we're going to do his, I'm not sure the exact weeks, I'll, um, of course that'll be in the title, but he's basically five months old. He turned five months old two days ago, so he's officially five months old. I just cannot believe how big he's getting already. It's just, it's insane. It just seems like I was just pregnant with him. <laughs> just brought him home from the hospital. But he's... He's a little fussier than Cameron was. He wants to be held all the time, which is okay. Um, you know, it doesn't bug me. It's just whenever I'm trying to do stuff with Cameron, then it's a little tricky. Um, you know, dealing with two kids at once is, is pretty tough. So, but I love him, and, and we're doing all right. Breastfeeding's going a whole lot better. I'm going to be doing a review of a product that I was allowed to, to try. And my supply is way better. I'm still having to give right at about a bottle a day. Sometimes I can go without giving a bottle at all, though. So my supply is way, way, way better than it was. So I'll be doing that review within the next week or two, most likely. I have a couple videos planned, so yeah, we'll do those. But it's it's great. Breastfeeding is going really, really well now. And, you know, he seems happy. My breasts seem full. Um more often you know they're not ever really uncomfortably full but they they feel heavier so I think he is getting a lot more milk I went to the breastfeeding clinic about a month ago and he got just a little over three ounces um, when he ate and I went this last Friday and he got four and a half ounces so that went up quite a bit and you know he was completely happy afterwards I think that there was still milk in my breast as well he was just he was full so he didn't want to eat anymore so in the that was around 10 when he ate and he ate around 6 30 before that so it was a little while um, I know it's it's still not fantastic but it's great for me so yeah so he's still mostly getting breast milk you know just a bottle here and there now um, you know max of about one bottle a day so it's been going great. It took a little while for that medicine to work, but it, it does work now, so. Hi. It's specifically designed for people that, you know, their breast tissue never increased, you know, in size or anything like that, so. I tried it and it worked, but the full review of that will be coming. That's not really what this video is about, but breastfeeding's going great, so. Yeah, hopefully we'll get to where we don't have to do any bottles at all, but we'll see when we get there. He is grabbing his hands and his feet all the time. He really, really likes to grab his feet. Um, if he has socks on, he tries to pull them off so he can actually hold on to his toes. Um, he likes to hold on to toys now a little bit more. He's, he drops them a lot, but he does like to try to grab a hold of them and blankets or anything like that. He is he's a little over 20, a little over 26 pounds now. Uh, not 26, geez, 16, <laughs> I'm thinking of Cameron, <laughs> he's a little over 16 pounds now, and he is doing great height-wise, I don't remember if I did an update on his doctor's appointment, but percentile-wise height, I don't remember the number, but he was 90th percentile, weight was I think about 50, and I can't quite remember the head, but I think it was around 40 maybe, so he's, he's a big guy, <gasps> who's that baby right there? Is that Noli Poli? Yes, it is. He He's pretty easy to make smile. Um, he really likes when his brother, you know, comes up and looks at him. And his brother's always trying to help him out. He always is trying to feed him food, though. So we've really got to watch Cameron with um, Nolan. Because he's always trying to give him, you know, a cookie or, you know, whatever he's eating. He'll try to feed him his milk <laughs> out of his sippy cup. And... He just tries to help out a lot. Anytime we change Nolan's diaper, I'll be like, we're gonna go change the baby's diaper, and he'll come, and he'll grab the wipes out, and he'll grab the diaper out, and he'll just be so excited to help out. He just, he loves trying to help his little brother out. He's not super gentle with him, like he, if he's in the way and he doesn't want him there, he'll try to pick him up or push him, and you know, stuff like that. So we've, of course, always gotta watch him. It's just like, I feel like my job is just to keep this one alive from Cameron. <laughs> oh, buddy. But we're doing great. He's 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 a lot of fun though. I, he's a happy baby. He smiles and laughs just a ton. It doesn't take a whole lot to make him happy. But he doesn't like to be put down. If he 
you just get in like the position of you're going to put him down and he'll start kind of whimpering <laughs> and then he'll start bawling if you put him down most of the time. He mostly sleeps with me. Um, at first, usually, um, for naps, of course, he'll sleep by himself. We'll put him in his crib or he'll fall asleep in his swing. Um, but for at night, usually what I'll do, I go to bed about midnight most nights, so then he goes to bed about that time, usually in his crib. He'll fall asleep in his crib. And then when he wakes up to nurse around, usually between 5 and 6, 6.30, somewhere in there, um, he will nurse and then he'll fall asleep in the bed with me. So basically whenever he wakes up in the night, I just take him to the bed, nurse him, and then he falls back asleep. So that's kind of what's been working for us. Um, I don't mind him being in the bed. It doesn't bug me a bit. I'm not really afraid of him getting... Um, used to it or anything like that. I didn't sleep with Cameron at all so this is a little different um, but he's actually nursing from me so um, it's just easier for me if he you know we both kind of fall asleep while he's nursing and and that's just what we do so yeah hi sweetheart this camera I need to get a new camera I think a video camera this one's just been auto focusing like crazy lately and I don't really want to redo the video so I probably won't but hi sweetheart he's chewing on everything he loves to chew on my fingers loves to chew on you know rags or towels or whatever just anything he can possibly chew on he tries to chew on <laughs> He's Cameron will stick his fingers kind of in his mouth sometimes and Nolan will kind of bite him and he'll get mad. He'll be like, bite! <laughs> so, I don't feel any teeth, but I would say he's teething. I mean, he absolutely wants to chew on everything. He's had some kind of green poop lately. I'm not sure if that's a breast milk imbalance or if it's because he's teething or what exactly is the cause of it, but it's more or less back to normal now, so... Yeah, still got really blonde hair. Our family pictures got postponed. Um, we're going to do them tomorrow, actually. Um, the lady that does our pictures was sick, of course, so we had to reschedule, which sucks, because, gosh, she's already going to be five months old, and we're supposed to have done these pictures. Newborn, three, six, nine, twelve months, so now we have to figure out when we're going to do the next ones. <laughs> but at least we're getting them done. I did do those other ones, so I don't feel as bad. The, they're still professional photos, but just from like a local walk-in place. So, he's, he's a great little guy though. But I think that'll be about it. Oh, you farted. <laughs> That's a stinky poop. I think you poop too. <gasps> Can you say bye-bye? Can you smile for mama? <gasps> <gasps> Alright, well, I'll talk to you guys later.